Thanks to injuries, the Red Sox have had a season in which they have almost never had enough outfielders. It started early with Carl Crawford not being ready for the regular season's beginning. And soon after, just seven games into the year, Jacoby Ellsbury went down with a dislocated shoulder. Both of those players are going to return very, very soon, though. And that means that the people who have been playing in their stead are going to need to either be traded, uh, sent back to the minors, or released. Uh, in the case of someone like Scott Petsednik, the, the answer is very clear. Uh, you trade Scott Petsednik if you get an opportunity because, as good as he was, you can't expect that kind of production going forward. If they kind of wanted a lottery ticket, that doesn't mean you need to go out and buy another lottery ticket. Uh, but with someone like Ryan Sweeney, things are a little more complicated. Sweeney is inexpensive, has another year of team control, and was part of the trade that brought Andrew Bailey to Boston in exchange for Josh Reddick and prospects. Uh, but because of that, Sweeney does have value to other teams. The Red Sox reportedly are not looking to move him, but he's the kind of player that could fetch them something at the deadline, if they, or sooner, if they need to clear up some room in the 40-man roster or just make room for Jacoby Ellsbury uh, so that he can play now. They have a kind of a similar player in some ways in Ryan Kalish. He's capable of playing all three outfield positions defensively. And while his bat isn't quite where Sweeney's is yet, it also has a much higher ceiling than Sweeney's. Uh, the Red Sox would miss him uh, as far as depth goes, uh, but they do have plenty of other outfield options around. Daniel Nava has established himself as someone who can actually play defense now, and he's a much more patient hitter than Sweeney, and has displayed more power over his brief career than Sweeney has. He might not be a regular, like Sweeney's capable of being sometimes, but if the concern is whether they're going to have enough depth or not, Nava is more than capable of filling that role. Because of this, there's a very good chance that Sweeney might be out of town soon. As said, the Red Sox reportedly are loath to trade him, but if someone comes up with the right offer and they don't have anywhere to play him anyway, then we just might see a trade happen.